This is the girl that talks about sex on TV. Uh, yeah, that's me. <laughs> I am Mexican, so when I saw your channel, I'm like, God bless us. <laughs> Just kidding. I was so excited mm -hmm. to see somebody open, willing to teach, but but I was like, she's not 60 years old. No. So explain me, how do you have all this knowledge? Um, just because I guess I'm a sex enthusiast, uh, like a massive sex nerd. So I just love learning about it and uh, basically like watching videos and reading books and articles and just talking about it a lot as well. Um, and I studied history at university and I specialized in sexual history. So that kind of like ties into my interest in that too. Yeah. Okay. I I want to ask you something because it was funny but I never learned that after you have sex with someone like there is this connection uh, like hormonal and emotionally okay, yeah, yeah. And, and nobody talks about that like you just break out and you're like just so heartbroken and sometimes it's not even that mentally you are sad it's just physically and yeah. uh, would you like to talk a little about that? Sure so there's just like a lot of hormones that happen around your body when it comes to sex and this goes for like anyone not just women because I think it's often very much like women get attached and women get hormonal um, after sex but like everybody releases oxytocin um, when they feel pleasure or have an orgasm and so that is like the cuddle hormone it makes you feel attached it's also the hormone that's released like um, when you give birth and like why you might feel attached to your child um, but yeah so that's all that good stuff but obviously it doesn't mean that you're definitely going to feel attached to someone that you had sex with like you may you may not but the thing you mentioned about like pain and heartbreak so like if you're in love you've got all of these like endorphins running through your body and and in, like the hormonal endorphins are natural um like pain uh -huh. um suppressors so they like increase your pain threshold so you like you know if you're exercising uh -huh. and it really hurts but then you've got all these endorphins going and so like it doesn't hurt as much does that make sense yeah 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 totally so you're in a relationship you've got all these endorphins then that relationship ends and you're heartbroken the endorphins go and you feel physical pain that's why like when you're going through heartbreak you're like why is this a physical feeling yeah now you know people <laughs> my last thing i want to hear your spanish oh the only spanish i know is rude is Say that okay yeah. uh donde están las putas <laughs> gracias <laughs> aquí <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, find me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. I do need a couple extra bucks. Thank you.